Hi everyone, my name is Shania. I am the pre-college outreach manager. My name is Dallas Martinez. I'm the community service manager. My name is Jim. I'm a social media manager. And my name is Kyle. I'm the membership manager. My name is Blair. I'm the finance manager. My name is Monica, and I am the assistant secretary. My name is Amy, and I'm the programs director. My name is Richard. I'm the marketing director. My name is Christina. I'm the treasurer. My name is Sonia Vasquez, and I am the primary secretary and vice president. My name is Caroline Pancho, and I am the president of UNLV Anderson College. I love NSMH because of all the opportunities presented to all students. As it has greatly impacted my experience at UNLV, I've met so many friends, and not only that, but when I first started on my freshman year, I was very quiet, shy, and it has definitely helped me become who I am today, outside of the box, and talk to basically all my friends that I have now. It makes me home. Especially, I am an international student. I come here alone, and then I met at SMH, and I knew a lot of new friends here, and all the volunteers and activities fill up my spare time in my college life, and I really enjoy it. I love at SMH because it's so inclusive and allows me to meet so many new people. It led me to meet a lot of new people. Like it's, it was a new community, and just getting to know people in this uh, this college right here, um, us all studying the same major and everything, just knowing that we all have this connection, and just being there for each other professionally um, and also outside um, from school and everything. That that's where I felt really connected, and that's why I decided like my junior year I want to put all my like head in and feet in, and like at this image just is where I want to be in. When I first came to UNLV, I wasn't too sure if I should pursue my education on hospitality. And then um, after I joined NSMH and being around with passionate people, I was sure that this is the path I want. So NSMH helped me grow career-wise and with my education as well. I think after I joined NSMH, I become an outgoing person, like especially like if you know me before, like I'm a person who's very shy and would not like to like approach others. Like that is not my personality. But after I joined this club, I felt like because all of, all the members are really friendly and they're really welcoming me, so I felt like I become more outgoing and try to be more confident to talk to each other. I talk to others and like that made me feel more happier. Like after I joined this club. NSMH has changed me in a few ways. My networking, I was good at networking before, but now with NSMH, I've had so many experience to meet new people and to grow my network. Another way is that I grew my confidence. I didn't have a leadership, I didn't have leadership experience prior to NSMH, but I took a step forward to take this role. NSMH has helped me become a better leader and become more open within the hospitality industry and help me meet new friends and lifelong lasting relationships. My favorite memory for this year was going to National for the first time. Uh, not only uh, meeting with those so many amazing chapters around the nation, uh, but uh, the place where we went to, the Atlanta, um, is a first place uh, where I actually immigrated up to, since to, uh, back in 2006. Um, it gave me a lot of great memories, and uh, going with the NSMH member uh, was definitely uh, such a great memory for me. And so I really enjoyed that trip. Favorite memory of NSMH has to be everything. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I got to along with a lot of the friends I've met at NSMH. So I'm closer. Shout out to my friends, Josephine, Alice, and Angela for being the best for me. <laughs> to future NSMHers, don't forget to have fun, study hard, but be dedicated to the organization because this organization will change your life. That's the thing is, I want to tell you guys to take to the tours, go network with your peers, go network with professionals and talk to them and you know what, find out what your passion is and go from there. Always go for your goals, make sure that you give 100% all the time and you can achieve anything that you set your mind to. To all the future NSMHers, my advice would really be to just don't be scared to put yourself out there. It's definitely scary going to your first um, networking event or just Doing something you've never done before and meeting people, you definitely need a lot of people. So don't be scared. Put yourself in those awkward situations. It will pay off. You'll make a lot of friends and you'll definitely grow not only personally, but professionally as well. Mm -hmm.
to you all future Anasumi trees. I would say advice and tip I would give you is don't be shy. Be out there and be involved. That's what any student organization is there for. The people who you meet in this organization in particular, we all have some type of common interest. So there's no need to be afraid of anyone. These people can become your forever friends, people who you can definitely call family, because that's what I definitely got out of this organization. So as I said, don't be shy, because I was shy. Don't be afraid, because I was afraid. And just be out there and have fun. I've been involved in NSMH since my freshman year, and these past three years, I've learned so much that I wouldn't have learned anywhere else. I can truly say that NSMH really changed me as a person and made me the person I am today, and I'm super grateful of all the opportunities and all the skills that I've gained being part of the office team, but also being involved as a member as well. It has been an extreme pleasure being this year's assistant secretary. I've been able to grow as a person, work, with amazing individuals and serve such a large group of amazing people. As Assistant Secretary, it was amazing to be able to get to meet so many new people just because of the role I had. I, I didn't just check people in, I introduced them to what NSMH was to me and I wanted it to be a comfortable place for everybody. Thank you everyone giving me the chance to become a uh, marketing officers for last year and I appreciate every single members and officer who does who helps me a lot and help me become a better person. Especially Caroline without her like like she's a spirit of this club. Without her I don't think our officer thing can do like this good. Thank you so much for you know you know keep visiting our social media platform and stay connected with us and um, thank you so much um, for all the officers team um, who helped me to grow better as a person and also um, just big shout out to uh, Richard, uh, my man, um, you know, you allow me to have the, uh, you know, your camera so a lot of times, you know, and so, you know, I feel so uh, sorry, but at the same time, you know, I'm so grateful. Also, Amy, um, I know you're graduating, um, you know, soon, I'll, you know, sincerely miss you as a friend. And also, a uh, big shout out to Caroline, um, who constantly um, also, you know, motivate me to um, be a better manager, um, you know, try to stay uh, creative uh, with my job. So I really thank you for that. Thank you to the rest of the officer team for their hard work and dedication to making this year the best memorable year and for making this chapter the chapter of the year national, nationally. And secondly, I'd like to thank all the members of NSMH for their dedication to this organization and for having fun and making different friends and relationships within this organization. I hope this this year has been the most memorable for me and I hope next year will be just as the same as the best. Thank you to everyone who has showed up to all of our events. It's honestly, it's honestly been really great meeting everyone, making all these new friends, and I just want to say thank you, but I will still be around, not graduating just yet, unfortunately, but I am getting there. Um, so yeah, see you next semester. Hey, thank you so much for the officers this year for working hard and become the chapter of the year second time in a row. And thank you so much for members um, for staying, being around with us and making a perfect team. And thank you for William for getting me involved with this nice club. Actually, it's my last year in UNLV and I'm gonna graduate and I appreciate NSMH so much because it makes me know a lot of friends here. People here are so nice to me and they help me no matter what. I really love here. I love all the people here. I love NSMH and it makes me to be a brave people. Uh, it makes me to be a brave person and it makes me more professional and makes me want to do further workings and career findings in hospitality industry. Well, I guess I am graduating and less than three weeks away and it's a crazy, crazy, exciting and very, a very daunting thought as well. It's been a great four years journey and I can't believe I made it out of California and straight just came out of Vegas by myself. But you know what? It's been a really great and amazing journey and 
what I want to say to everyone is I still don't have much shit. I still don't know what I want to do after graduation, you know, like what specifically like career I want to do or anything. It's a big question mark, like I legit do not know. And that's the thing is like um, I struggle so much is like I don't know what I want to do, I don't know about this, I don't know about that, but sometimes stressing so much about it about life that when you don't have the answer, you don't know when it's gonna come. It's not gonna come as even if you just sit here and think, I don't know, I don't know. So what I wanna say is like right now, it's okay. You know, like it's a big question mark right now, but I want to go out there and I want to live my life passionately and just figure out what my passion and live it out. And that's what I want everyone um, to do as well because I know a lot of you guys are about to graduate as well. You guys are moving through your um, school, career, um, life, and you're moving past. You're going to be junior, seniors, and you guys are going to be in my spot the um, same way. And I know a lot of people might be thinking about the same way and have question marks too. And I just want you to tell you guys, like, it's fine. It's going to be all fine because we're young. We're 20 something years old and we have like how many more years? Yes, life can be very short, but it can also be very, very long if you make it. Um, so just live this life as much as you want and just, you know what, remember who you are, find out who you are and just live passionately. It may not be easy just for yourself to do it. Peace out.